find the third term of the following expansion. So now they give you guys the we're only looking for the third term. So don't go over one. You guys say, do I need to do the Pascal triangle for the twelfth row? Not really. If you notice, all of the first numbers are exactly the same. So I know that my third term will be the first, the second, and the third term. I know that my first term, the number will be six. Be six. Now for the value of a, will be four x. So I know that this will be four x, four x, and four x. Now the x and 4x on each one of them all the way to the 13th number. Remember, it starts with 12. This is a 12, but you'll have 13 terms. My exponent, this is a 12, 12, 11, and 10. We're only looking for the third term, not for the entire thing. So let's see, if 6 is 6, they were all the same. 4x to the 10th, so I know that's not it. And I know this one's not it. Now, letter B will be a negative 8. This is a 10. They need to add to 12, so my exponent will be 2. So therefore, my answer is letter B. And just be careful. Don't forget your negative as part of your answer. Now, from there, if I want to simplify, I can just go through the process of simplifying, but it will get pretty large numbers. 